Progress is ongoing for a project in Kalamazoo looking to make the city streets more friendly for those not on four wheels. David Horak explains all new at 7. I think it's a matter of awareness for drivers. Staying alert while behind the wheel is obviously a must, and an ongoing project near certain Kalamazoo neighborhoods is helping drivers keep an extra eye out. It's not pleasant to cross either of those streets, and there are a lot of people out walking and pedestrians and bicyclists, and so we want to do something. Stemming from more than two years of public feedback, West Nedge and Park are the two final streets of a calming project by Imagine Kalamazoo and the city. After the same was done for Stockbridge, Winchell Avenue, Emerald Drive, and Greenleaf Boulevard. City staff members say concerns range from speeding to having clear and comfortable places for transit, bike, and foot traffic all around. How do pedestrians walk along and across these streets and feel comfortable doing it? Uh, same for cyclists and transit riders who eventually become pedestrians when they are either getting on or off the bus. Currently, the first phase is installing radar and pedestrian signs and painting crosswalks at every other intersection. City planner Christina Anderson says drivers should expect short-term delays at worst. This is not something that is major construction that would be multiple days. Um, paint dries pretty quickly, right? And so it can be done. It can be done fast. And beginning next year, the project's second phase will look to dictate where on-street bicycle lanes and parking are, among other pedestrian improvements and opening the door for crosswalk art. There's only so much room in the street to do things. And so we have to trade off where bike lanes might be and where parking might be. And city engineers are already noticing measurable improvements since the project began. They say drivers on average are going two miles an hour slower through these areas, really allowing pedestrians to take it easy while taking a stroll. In Kalamazoo, David Horak, News 8.